Hello Alice. Uh, this is the Tolatone's Resurrection. So we're going through the whole song today, okay? Uh, so first bar is G and B, open strings. Then we play C natural with the first finger. And now with the fourth finger D, with an open string G. Okay, the rhythm is... Allow the bass note to ring, okay? Uh, then after, third finger on C with the first open string. You keep your third finger pressed while you play the F natural on the first string, okay? So keep on holding your third finger and play G on the upper string. Now move your first finger to F sharp with a D on the bass, fourth string. Second finger on G. Allow the bass to ring, okay? And then after you play the bass again with an A on top. And now G with G, okay? So G on the first string with the third open string. Next bar is G played in two different voices. So we're going to play G here on the fourth string. 5th fret with the 3rd open string. It's the same G in both voices, okay? Uh, now you can move your finger out because the G on the 3rd string is still ringing. Play B, that's the 2nd open string. And now C sharp with your 1st finger and G, the 3rd open string. Now with your 2nd finger D, with F sharp on the 4th fret of the fourth string. Now you move your little finger to D with the third open string. This is going to allow you enough time to prepare your third finger on C, okay? So you C with the first open string. Now you play F sharp on the first string, but keep the C ringing, okay? Now, first finger on E and the fourth finger on G. And second finger on F sharp with the fourth open string. Now, second finger on D with the third open string. So you play once, D again, and on the third time the bass changes to F sharp. And back to the E with the G, okay? First finger and fourth again, okay? Carry on, second finger on F sharp with the fourth open string. Now it's open strings, okay? So fifth open string with the first one. D, natural, and again the fifth open string with the first one. Back to D, but now we play the fourth open string. Next bar. We are going to play, use the first finger on D uh, with the G on the bass, that's the third open string again. Now A on the high string with your fourth finger and F sharp with your second. Now you move, slide your fourth finger to G and play with the E on the bottom and second finger on F sharp with the D on the bass. Okay, so it's very similar to the previous part. Now, fourth finger on D with the third open string, one more time. So very similar to the previous part as well. Uh, this allows you time to play the C on the fifth string with your third finger, together with the first open string. This bass, you don't have to allow it to ring because the bass changes to E. So it's E with your second finger on the fourth string with the second open string. Now you play C sharp with your third finger and you change from the third to the fourth finger uh, for D with D on bass as well, okay? C natural, G and B open strings. Now C with C octaves, fourth finger on D Allow this bass note to ring, 
and the first open string, okay? So you play the three notes uh, on the upper melody while you keep your finger on the bass note, okay? Now, D with D, you can use your fourth finger here, C natural, and G and B open strings again, okay? Now C and C octaves, D and A, so you play the A with your second finger, and now G octaves, so G on the sixth string with the third open string. Now, with your little finger, you play the G on the first string, with the second and third strings open. G again, and a third time. Now you move your little finger to B on the seventh fret, and play the third open string. Okay? Now back, this is, uh, again, uh, very similar to a previous part. So, little finger on A, this is the uh, fifth fret, and second finger on F sharp. Now you slide the fourth finger until the third fret and move your first finger to E. Okay? Allow the bass note to ring while you play F sharp with your second finger. Now open strings, fifth open string with the first open string and F sharp with the fourth string on the bass. Now third finger on D, with your third open string, okay, C, with the first open string, F sharp with your first finger, allow the bass note to ring as well, and now you play G, and repeat the bass, okay? Now, G, with D, move to C natural, third and second open strings and the ending is exactly the same as the previous part so C and C octaves D and A, A with your second finger and now G octaves, so G on the sixth string with the third open string, okay?